Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install Oracle Linux 9.2 on VMware Workstation. The process is same for Oracle Linux 7 or Oracle Linux 8 or Oracle Linux 9. First, download by going to the site m.oracle.com. This is the website to download Oracle Linux. Click on here, download Oracle Linux, then click on get started here. Then click on this Oracle Linux installation media for x86, 64 and ARM. See here, we have several kinds of ISO images like full ISO, UVK boot ISO, boot ISO, source ISO. Scroll down, see here, we have the versions from 6.8 to 9.2. Here, see full ISO, boot ISO and UVK boot ISO source ISO. Click on the first one that is full ISO. See once we click on download has been started. Go to downloads. See I have already downloaded the ISO file. Its the size is 9.6 gigabytes. I am cancelling this one. In your case wait until download completes. Once download is completed then open VMware workstation. If you haven't installed VMware workstation then go to the link provided in the video description and install it. VMware. See, I have installed VMware workstation player. Maximize this one. See, I have these virtual machines. Now click on create new virtual machine. Then select installer disk image file. Then click on browse. Then select the downloaded ISO file. Then click on next. In the drop down. See, we have up to Oracle Linux 8. Select the latest one. Then click on next. Here we have to provide the name for this machine. I am giving name as ORCL Web App. This is the location to store this virtual machine files and folders. Click on next. Storage. I am giving hard disk as 40 gigabytes. Click on next. See, this is the summary of the virtual machine. If you want to edit any one of them, just click on customize hardware. See, I am going to change memory. By default, it has selected 1 gigabyte. I am changing it to 4 gigabytes. Use this R. Just change the number. 44096. Or use this arrow. Then click on close. See, memory has been changed. If you satisfied with this summary, just click on finish. Wait, I see. see. Now we have to right click and click on power on or click on this power on, click on this play virtual machine. All three are same. Use up and down arrows and select. I am going to select the first one that is install Oracle Linux 9.2 and hit enter. Now select the language and click on continue. Here select the installation source. I am going with the default one. Then we have to, it is mandatory to check this red highlighted options. Installation destination and root password. Click on installation destination. I am going with the default destination. Then click on done. Then scroll down. If you want to select the software selection, click on software selection. You can select any one of them. But I am going with the server with GUI. Then click on OK. Done. Now we have to set root password. I am giving root password as I like. 
then click on done see it is saying it is a eek password so don't worry click on done now before this begin installation was grayed out now it has been enabled now click on begin installation to start the installation of oracle linux on vmware workstation player See, installation has been completed successfully. Click on Reboot. After Reboot, we will configure the post installation steps. Click on Reboot. Now click on start setup. If you want to enable local services, you have to keep this on, otherwise off. Then click on next. If you want to connect any one of these online accounts, you have to select and provide the credentials. Otherwise, click on skip. Now we are going to create user other than root. I'm giving username as r to schools. This is the full name and this is the username. Then click on next. Here I'm going to provide password for the new user that is r then click on next we have successfully configured everything then click on start using oracle linux if you want to see the tour you have to click on take tour otherwise no thanks double click on this one again double again click on it see now we have maximize click on activities click on show applications See, these are the default applications comes with Oracle Linux. Click on Terminal. Verify whether this is Oracle Linux 9.2 or not. More slash etc os hyphen release. See, we have installed Oracle Linux server and its version is 9.2. It is of family Fedora. The first step that we have to do after installation is sudo dnf update this is the first step after the installation of oracle linux server then we have to provide the password this may take time so i am cancelling this one so in this video we have seen how to download and install oracle linux 9.2 on vmware workstation player for more videos please subscribe my channel thank you